but also I'm going to make sure you see the best parts of me. Does that make sense? How many of you invest into your costumes? It's a big part of it. How many of you take your time getting ready, hair, makeup, the works? Right? It's a big part of it. It's your way of controlling the narrative. Yes, you can look at me, but I control what you see. That's very empowering. So if you skip those steps, don't. You're depriving yourself of a lot of confidence. Okay? What else can we do to make sure that we look good? I disagree, but we'll get there. What else can we do to make sure that we look good? Yes, before we get there, guys, go into the room, especially those of you that just came in. There's space for you. Also, you can take up more space here. What is the number one tool your body has that helps you look good? Your posture, right? Okay, so how do we get a good posture? What's good posture? Who knows? Right? How many of you create tension when you create a good posture? Squeezing your shoulder blades down, holding your abs, all the things. Right? That's going to make it really hard to dance. So if you work on posture by going, huh, huh, what do you think is going to happen when you go on the dance floor? You're going to lose it. Yeah? So this is the first tool I'm going to give you today. We're going to work on your posture. Your posture starts where? In your feet. Yes? Okay. So looking at me, looking at me, this is also one of the most important performance tools. To be a great performer, you have to learn to multitask your focus. We'll work on that today. Okay? What does that mean? It means I can focus on multiple things happening in my body at the same time. So as I take you through an exercise to develop good posture, I want you to also start developing good awareness skill. Okay? So looking at me, looking at my favorite part of the day. <laughs> looking at me, looking at me, right? Feel your feet. Can you feel your feet? Can you feel your feet and look at me at the same time? Yes. Are you sure? Can you feel your feet, look at me, and feel the floor you stand on? Mm -hmm. Okay, stay there. Keep looking at me. Hey, Dennis, how good does my room look right now? Right? You guys look amazing already. That's all it took. Was that hard? Are you working hard right now? Good. Do you think you can keep that in your show? Yes. Not yet. Okay, so we'll practice a little bit more. Okay. All right, so you feel your feet. You feel the ground beneath you. That is the most important thing for you to do always. Do you know why? That's the sense of I am safe. Do you think you're going to put on a good show if you're scared? No. no. Right? Everybody wants to feel confident. And we prepare, right? And the more you prepare, the more you feel secure. That works. But also, you need to feel safe. It is very possible to prepare and still freak out. Yes? You've been there. I've been there. I'm there right now. I teach this class for a living, and I'm like, oh my god, everybody's looking at me. Right? That's a normal feeling. So as long as you can feel the ground beneath your feet, never mind how much that helps you as a dancer, right? As long as you feel the ground beneath your feet, you're safe. Yes? Yeah. Feel your feet. Got it? Look at me. Ooh. <laughs> Look at me. Got it? Feel your feet. Look at me. Reach the top of your head up. There's a difference between the top of your head and your chin, right? Watch this. If I go like this, do I look tall? Right? If I go like this, do I look tall? Good. I work on that so much. 
It hasn't helped yet. <laughs> Do my best. Okay, I feel my feet, I focus my eyes, I stretch the top of my head up. Do you notice how that instantly gives me a little buzz in my energy? Right? The buzz outside of my microphone buzz. So watch me again. Here is me being human. Here is me being dancer. Do you see the difference? What's the difference? I invite life into my spine. Okay? So let's try that together. Feel your feet, drop your weight, feel comfortable, feel safe, keep your eyes focused. It doesn't have to be on me, but keep your eyes focused. Now, stretch the top of your head up and feel all of that space in your spine. Feel how yummy, yummy that is. That's you. That's your beautiful energy. That's your beautiful life. That's what you come here to share. You're not gonna believe me when I say the following words, but considering that I've been dancing for 30 years, won everything under the sun, and then taught a whole bunch of other people how to do the same thing, you should. If you are able to go on stage, feel this part of you, everything you do will be amazing. And then your level of skill matters a lot less, okay? Stage presence is a skill you can develop that allows you to have a good time and put on a good show, even if you're not very good, okay? And that's fair because the body takes time and you should take that time to get very good in your skill, but it's okay if you're not because you can still put on a good show. Does that make sense? Okay, so I feel my feet, I'm grounded, I stretch the top of my spine up. I feel the life inside me. It's spacious, right? I've now also created a lot more room to move and that feels good, yes? Okay, what's the other tool that's really important here? <laughs> 